Now, I thought I, I thought I would start having you here with me while I try to do this. Last time I posted this, it disappeared. It just now it's like it's like uh, I sort of think like I used to think that maybe I wasn't smart enough that I that I never figured it out soon enough, but they knew before me. There was and it was uh, definitely uh, when they uh, took my hair sample from for that armed robbery. They definitely knew I was Harry's kid then. I'll tell you, cause it showed them there, and they checked it out, and then they hit it. And then when I got a judge, a judge that's supposed to do that, nope. So it's very simple, you know. You knew, but and it's very simple. I know the date it's gonna happen and over with, and it's coming close. Three years, I think now. After waiting 25, I think I can do it. I think I can do it. I can. can I got you. Of course, you know, what do you do when you live in a shoe? You move to a boot, you get a hoot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And to think what happened to Alice, you know, that was the meanest woman I've ever met. The meanest. Totally friggin' mean. And, uh, he, uh, She was uh, very, very, very mean. Very, 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 very. She, she would take uh, pigs out with, with hammers. Like, she was a tough chick. And then to have God strike her like that in a stroke? Like, come on. She went from being invincible to helpless. And then when, when she's laying there in the bed for, for like stiff, like helpless, like that that must have, that must have just been the most terrifying thing to her being helpless, you know. Terrifying, terrifying, terrifying. And then after that, when the people around her were probably getting. You know, resentful, having to change your shit and clean your, you know, you know, all that stuff. That, that'll just wear on you, man. And how can you live with yourself that you're like that? It's just, it's just, it's unbearable. So I imagine she's just hating everything, and then all of a sudden she sees that hurricane come in there, and all of a sudden, boom, it destroys everything, and she's gone. Like, and you know, you know, she ended up in hell. You know that they never get back together. Like, you just know it. Because she denied the spirit. Like, especially, <laughs> everything is truth. Like, when you stand in front of God and His plan, that's denying the spirit. So, if you haven't figured it out, that would mean that like, most of the medicine hat is going to hell. And you can, you can be sugarcoat anything, but when you deny the spirit, it doesn't work that way. Death. So, I can understand why this, this, this town is so dead for religion. I could understand when COVID came, there wasn't even people standing up for God. You know, like telling us to how many people can get together. My God. You go up to Calgary, Edmonton, there's people doing time. Ministers doing time for getting busted. You know, real Christians? You know, it's just like, oh, oh, oh. I don't have to do nothing. They think, you know. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Like, what do you do when you live in a shoe? Yeah, move to a boot and have a hoot. I'm going to shut this off so that I can put it up here.